Cause man, turn it up. Nah, I'ma keep it a buck. Tristan hit that, cause there ain't no way that. What's going on everybody? It's your girl Vina. And it's your boy Groove. And we are back with another video. Wait, how are you guys? <laughs> yeah man, it's been a minute. How y'all doing man? All right, this is, it's been a while since we actually sat and talked to the camera. Yeah, yeah chop it up with y'all. Drop a comment, let us know. Real shit. Anywho, we just literally came from the hospital. We had to take that to the hospital. Yeah, the doctor's appointment, everything checked out good. He looking all right. Yeah, they say he a little stubby. But <laughs> I don't know what they told me about. I don't know what they told me about because I think that that's pretty small. But other than that, Zaza is doing good. So today we gonna shoot something juicy, okay? We I know y'all all heard about it. That whole situation with Chloe, Jordan. Actually, it's not even Chloe. Jordan and Tristan Thompson. Facts. Chloe's baby father. So I know who Tristan Thompson is. He played for the Cavaliers. I know who he is, you feel me? But I don't know who this Jordan girl is, man. So Jordan is Kylie's best friend. Right. So so Chloe's little sister's best friend. Alright, which one? Alright, Kylie, the one with the makeup? Yeah, the one with oh, the makeup. Right. 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 And she literally well, the rumor is she she fucked Chloe's man. <laughs> well, we about to find out all the juicy stuff right, right. now. So we tuning in to Jada's Picket Red Table Talk tonight. That, that show was lit too. I ain't even gonna hold it. <laughs> and we just gonna record this and y'all gonna see our natural reaction. So we got to watch this with y'all. I hope this is as juicy as it sounds because honestly, I just don't know what would possess her to even do that or why. Yeah, he's not even, never, never mind, you know what I'm saying, he's not even gonna sit there and talk about that man like that, but you feel me? He, he must be doing something, he, he up there slamming everything. I don't even, I don't even understand the concept behind it, like why would he think it's okay? Or why would she think it's okay? Like, I don't know who's more wrong in this situation, but we are gonna watch how it play out. Yeah, honestly, they both wrong if you ask me. If, that, yeah. if that's what that, that's what happened, because you know these, these speculations right now, you feel me? I don't, I don't really know what's going on. Right. Oh, and, and, oh no. yeah, and this is going to be a mukbang because we eating, guys. Definitely, y'all. So I got me my food. Got my food. You know, I like a bowl, so, you know, I threw mine in a bowl. See the different personalities? I do plates. He do bowls. That's crazy. You know, when I eat in a plate, it take away from my scooping abilities. I like to scoop when I... And I eat with a fork. <laughs> I eat with a spoon, you feel me? <laughs> I don't play no games. Right, so let's let's just get right into it, guys. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. This. Mm. Mm. Well, I've been asked several times, like, what's, what's been the hardest red table that you've ever had? Mm. It's been rough. So, guys, we eat Spanish rice, chicken, and avocado. Many more artists, but her father, John Woods, was a sound engineer on the Fresh Prince of Bel Air for its entire run, where he and Will became friends. Their sons, Josh Woods and Trey, became very close, and through many play dates between them, Jaden and Jordan ended up becoming true day ones by forging a close lifelong bond oh, since they were infants. So Jordan cool These way. friendships made the wood. Jordan, family wait, family. Will and who? Jordan Jordan parents. Parents. Who's Jordan parents? Who's parents? Who's Jordan's parents? Jordan and Jordan and Kylie oh, Will Smith. Jordan, and the two became inseparable. Okay. Friendships okay. between Jaden, Jordan, and Kylie brought three families together where many bonds were made. Okay. In February, guests at a house party reported that Jordan, Put the and NBA star Tristan, Bye. the father of Khloe Kardashian's daughter, was and that Jordan spent Messiah. the The immediate online and media backlash that follow has forced three families, the Woods, Kardashian and Jenner's, and the Smiths, into a painful and very public incident. So when Jordan reached out to me and Wait. asked me if I would help her story to be heard, I invited her to the red table to figure yeah, out that's how good to that heal, she reached out. heal, and move forward. Look, that, Jordan was there that, um, this is real grown woman stuff, right? We have a platform now, voice of opinion. For sure. As women, we all let our little girl behavior get us into some grown woman mess. Jada, mom! She be on point right though. Yeah. She, and she, and she look good. She definitely doing. Hey! Oh my God, Will. 
well. Willard. I didn't think that they come to the table like this, but it's the best place to be. Hey, listen. That table has mythological cleansing and healing power. <laughs> I believe that. <laughs> I would have loved to be there. There's a lot of things about our relationship to our family. Jordy's father worked on Fresh Prince before she was born. I know how hard it was for you and your family when you passed. And I'm watching you grow and become a woman. And I had a deep sense that we would be here one day. And what I want to say to you is that the world attacks. It just happened. You'll never get around the world attacking. But I want you to know that you are supported and I got you and we got you. Yeah. That means the world to me. Yeah. You know me before I knew myself. Yeah. Babe, yeah. do you have any fatherly advice? Uh, I was about to say that he likes a pot. <laughs> she calls him uncle. This is a part of what growing up is. This is a part of what learning is. Boy, I'm glad I ain't got a dog. Part of what she she is. Yeah. But Will is so wise. This world is not going to break you. We won't allow it. Yeah. The world's going to attack. Oh, oh, I love you. You in a public eye. Yeah. You do but things like that. kids really in a public eye. Like that's real talk. Yeah. Well, let us go do it. Let's go to the <laughs> table. All right, give me a hug. You heard what Will said. We got you. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. Let's shake your hand. I don't even know when we began. Well, I'm going to start with. <clears throat> I have known Jordan Woods like she about to cry. for her entire life. And... I just want everybody to know that anybody that's coming to the table today needs to understand that A, we're dealing with a really sensitive subject and we need to deal with it with compassion. And anybody who wants to come to the table and act like they haven't done something in their life that they wish they could have done different, if you feel as though you don't have any skeletons in your closet, Everybody else, everybody else. If you feel holier than thou, this might not be the place for you. Stop. I'll be right back. I'm going to go check every closet in here. The best way to deal with this kind of stuff is just to come clean. The first thing that I want Don't snitch on yourself. Nah, it's not your snitch. Don't do it. I can do that. Is that... There's a family that feels betrayed by you. And you're clear about that, right? Okay. But what about him? I want to give you the opportunity to tell He don't you. care! The same I way you get him is the same way you lose him. Of what your part has been. You don't get too shit. Because that's the only part you can change. Now you go out with the oldest. And that's system. the only part that no, you the only you so the oldest. for. So, so, the one that looks like she's the oldest, but she's not. So. Oh, all right. She's the youngest. The tall one, the big one. The big one. That's yeah. what I meant. The one who dated Lamar. OJ Simpson. Sunday night, I went to dinner with some friends. <laughs> and I went to this bar after there was a party going on. Sure. I was minding my business, cool. dancing, drinking. Tristan was there. He was doing his own thing. That was it. After the club, normal LA culture when we're young, go to the bar, go to the club, it ends early. We all go to a house after. Right? Mm -hmm. They are like I'm not what, thinking 22? about whose house or mm -hmm. where. In fact, we're just, you know, we're all having fun. We're in the moment. The group of girls that I'm with are like, you know, we're going to go to a house. On the way out, they're saying it's Tristan's house. I'm like, cool. Is that his That's life? okay. Feels like a safe environment. I'd rather it be. Go to the house, house. Like, right. Right. He didn't even personally invite me there. It wasn't like, come see me. It was like, oh, I'm hopping in the car. I'm coming with y'all. Y'all are going here. Cool. I know him even better. Right. We yeah. pull up. We walk in. Not once was I aware of anyone's phone or told them to take away a phone. I was not paying. I don't care. I don't have anything to hide. Right. So when it comes to the phones being taken away, I have no 
clue who told them to take away the phone, anything. Right. All I know is I had my own. Right. But, uh oh. And I think she's playing the victim role. Yes. Yeah. That's why she went to the red table. I'm not thinking. She ain't know that they said I to put the phone away. Right. And that's my first step where I went wrong. And how I would feel mm -hmm. if someone close to me is is hanging on my ex's house or yes. the father of my child. I wouldn't I didn't think about that. That's the first part of the problem. So you're saying now so, say I shouldn't have been there in the first place. Yeah, that's the, the first step is I that's should have why you might think about that before. The party. I does she thought, does she say what? Well, she thought he was cool, you know. Oh, I know him even better. We just went to parties. Was I giving him a lap dance, making out with him, sitting all over him? It's just. What did you do then? We're all together. We're in a group. Never once did we leave the public area, go to a bedroom, go to a bathroom. We're all in plain sight. And you have other girls with you. Yes. Okay. Why do you think no one else has stepped up? To defend. I want people to stand up and be accountable, but I don't want anyone to feel what I'm feeling. Yeah, I get it, because let me tell you, I've been here, yeah, I get it, and it's hard for people. It is, mm -hmm. and there's no right or wrong to it. It's just hard. And, it's heat. and why do they owe me right. that much? Right. That's they're your friend. what from the night was suggested. Nah, they got it all twisted. Something more has this happened. this seems completely yeah. crazy to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm that anybody says there was a lap dance involved because <laughs> there was no lap dance involved. But what I can Were you drunk? Think is to what is drunk? Was say that there was a chair here, a couch, and another chair. Got it. It's all filled. Got it. So he's sitting in this chair and there's an arm of the chair that goes up about here. Okay. And I'm sitting on the arm of the chair. Oh, so now he was on the arm of the chair. Look, and you see me sitting on the like, chair in no, my bitch, head. I mean, my fool. This is yeah, insane. You know, like, we're all drinking. We're chilling. Keep There's the no way it would look like a lap dance. But I could see why people would say, oh, they're getting cozy. Mm -hmm. Did you have your arm around them? No. Okay. But Jada the legs were, this girl so. were laying yeah, right so over his. Right. Wow. She her. said there was what? Mm -hmm. My butt was never sitting on him, but your legs were so he But was, my legs were dangling down, so I picked them up and I put them over. To look to, to onto his legs. Onto the bottom of his legs, yes. Onto the bottom of his mm -hmm. legs. There's stories that yeah. she was sitting on his lap, she was uh -huh. dangling in his his crotch area. She that is no, not no, the no, truth. No, dangling in his crotch area. A story, I can understand why. That would be the story. She was busting it down like Dr. Young. Like intimate little <laughs> chuckle chuckle, little giggle giggle. Mm -hmm. You in his ear, him in your ear. I mean, I was, we all were just dancing and having fun. Everyone at the party Why were you dancing with him at all? Person, this person, but never anything intimate. Never anything like that. And he didn't make any moves on you throughout the night. No. Ruff is good. He didn't try to take me to a room. He didn't try to. We were all. It was just an innocent time. But you could see how that could seem. And that's where I will take responsibility to where I can't be doing that. Right. Right. Especially I mean, with the partner of a woman who considers you a sister, and they already exactly. have. Because that's there's so much history involved. Yeah. yeah. I wasn't thinking right. Yeah. That's, I take full responsibility for that. Because the other difficult part was like, okay, Jordan left at 7 a.m. and you know it's hard for people to believe that nothing happened. Nothing happened. She left at 7. I understand why. Why? Did I say one more chicken? In my life, in my world. It makes sense. Like two minutes before, I've been she on the party binge where that wasn't supposed to stay till 6 in the morning. Right. They do. There was always somebody there. Even up until the moment that I left, there were people there. I finally looked outside and I'm like, look, the sun's coming up. I need to take myself home. Right. And it's usual for you not to go home at that time. Why are you looking at the sun like, oh, and it's time for me to shut up. You know, it's fine. You can, you can be safe here. And I'm like, you know what? 
I need to go. My car's outside. I had to drive outside. It's been waiting. Um, so this is where the story gets tricky because I feel like I can't point fingers. You can't. Don't do it. And I can't Daylight say this, well in him. you did this or you did because I allowed myself to be in that position. That part right there. I allowed myself to be there. And All her friends must I never was belligerently drunk to where I can't remember what happened. So you never had a blackout moment? No, I was never blacked out. But there was alcohol involved. There was alcohol involved. So how mm -hmm. drunk were you? I, I was drunk. Remember. Okay. I was not tipsy, I was drunk. She really did. But I was just not beyond the point of recollection. I know oh, where I was. But you knew exactly where you were. On the way out, he did kiss me. No. And he gave me by a kiss. It's just no passion, no nothing on the way out. He just kissed me and Where you where? We like kissed you. Kiss, like a peck on the lips, <laughs> peck on the lips. Yeah, no, it, it was like a kiss on the lips. But no tongue kiss, no making out. Come on, uh, man. Why did you allow him to and kiss you? And I don't think that he. Why he felt comfortable to kiss you? That's the real question. To be in that position, and when alcohol's involved, people make it ain't no liquor. Dumb moves or people make up that. in the moment, or who knows? Were you shocked? No. I didn't know how to feel. She wasn't shocked because she just gave I it was up. Like, she definitely did it. Just happened because you know I was leaving and I just sort of walked out immediately after. And I got in the car and... You know why she went to Jada? The red table? Why? Wow. Jada was gonna come at her like but one of these other people. And so you left You did what? Where? How? When? Did you say it? Did you say it? Little bags with all the real juice. I was just like, I need to go. I was in shock. I was more so like, did this really... You know, I don't... Okay. You knew it happened! Let me just pretend like that. Stop playing! Killing me. Did you have any? How, uh, no. Why when you're in situations like that, you know what the hell you're doing. I'm there. People so try to blame on her. She was attracted to him. Right. And she never made she liked it. He kissed me. No, bitch. She we kissed. Y'all kissed, so, okay? What? She kissed me. What happened? I'm talking about he kissed me. She gave it up before they kissed. I was in the morning and I told him I was there. And I had talked to Chloe and she, you know, asked me what's going on, is everything fine? And in my head of trying to forget that part of the story, I was just like, you know, no, he was he was chilling, everything was okay. Like there were girls saying lying like, about it. Now you're hiding some girls. You didn't she only like, want to come out and tell me when she got caught. Right. 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 She is supposed to be like, yo. I was almost in there, but I wasn't honest about the action that had taken place. You're still not Did being honest. trying to protect their relationship at that time? I just knew how much turmoil was going on that I was like, let me not just throw hey, you know more fuel on the fire. Why I was, not put out I the fire by to protect me. telling the truth? Chloe's heart? Show them Zaza. Yeah. Oh. She doesn't deserve this either. Right. You know, people no, don't have even that. dehumanized her in this situation to where they don't they can't feel uh, nosies. But why are you crying? Is he nosies? And it's God. not fair that she has to deal with this either. And the last so thing I wanted to do was be you that ain't person. Do nothing wrong. I'm no homewrecker. You are a homewrecker. I would never try to hurt someone's home. Especially someone that I love. Right. And I she has a beautiful daughter. I never would try to steal someone's home. I don't need your situation. I really just she was up there beatboxing on that shit. Like not telling the truth. Do you feel as though you are the reason why Tristan and Chloe are not together? I know I'm not the reason that Tristan and Chloe are not together. Oh, so it's what it is. Who did it? It harder for her to want to be with him. So they've been going through things. And this is me. Why you put her laundry out there though? I'm sorry. Ask you straight up. Okay. Did you sleep with Tristan? Never. She's never. lying. Never consideration. Never happened. Never will I. Oh, y'all ain't and sleep together. Y'all was really awake. To be put up to the test. 
there was a way. Attaching me to a lie detector, whatever it is, I need people to know the truth. And more importantly, I need the people involved to know the truth. <coughs> Just to clarify, there has been no communication so with Tristan, no relationship One night stand. Over time. You guys didn't have a relationship for a month. There's been years. no relationship. Okay. No communication, no plans on meeting up, no conversation, nothing. Right. been around for almost a decade. I'm here to protect and yeah. never here to hurt anyone. And I think if that was the case, I, I wouldn't have been friends with these people for so long. She was beatboxing you know, on it. You know, I have 20, to deal with my family money. and all the people I hurt. That family also has to deal with the hurt. So you didn't hurt Tristan? This story that didn't have to be what it was right turned into the biggest scandal or betrayal of the year. <laughs> because I've seen what has been done to my life in only a week based on how the she lost her promotions, her sponsorship, a whole bunch of lies. Because Chloe gave her a lie. They're putting their focus With on the young black people. They get a collaboration. They made a mistake. You were sitting up and not a mistake that's worth public crucifixion. Public it's a mistake that should have been dealt with internally. We well, you know what they say. Yeah. Black women can be the most disregarded and Guilty. On earth. You know, being a black woman in the game, for so long as I've been, just seeing that without people even having heard your side and just not giving the benefit of the doubt, it just always seems like it's so easy to just target black it's women, easy, right? put everything on us. People are always trying people to involved. play the black card. Like this right here, playing the black card. To be here, it's playing the black card. To, be here, black here, black card. to, to realize to feel it, because yeah. I saw it, <laughs> but I never felt it. Right. I think that's one of the reasons why Uncle Wayne no, felt No, you right did something wrong, important. and you need to just for completely him own that story. That's a fact, like, ain't nothing wrong right. with being grimy and doing And it hurts. Things. You're gonna get things that's taken away from you, but you know what kind of words you can shit. Is. You can shine so much exactly. more accepting your, I really felt your ugliness, you feel me? No, she not. Opportunity. She gonna lose everything. No, I'm saying, she could shine so much more after what she gonna go through all her bounce back. Look at Cardi, look at Cardi B accepting who she is, you feel me? That's a different. Different kind of. Man, listen. This is a different style. 6'9 accepting who he is, a little rat. You feel me? You can just get those arms around me. And the crazy thing is, the arms that I thought would be around me are nowhere to be found. Right. Yeah, because look what you did. Days of this you, can't, you can't be trusted around other people. Or they men. Or like, somebody in a relationship with because you have made yourself that kind of person to be trusted. That's a fact. You see Will not on the channel. That's not the reason why. <laughs> You don't know that. He said he couldn't be there. I know, because Jada wasn't having that. Page, it's another she like, I watched this little girl grow up. You ain't about to take my word. You're telling me something like your father deserved to die. Uh, what? I may have done something wrong, no, they but whatever I did, I don't think I deserve this. It's just, <laughs> it's not fair. It took you too far If with that. I was a weak person, I would have hurt myself. It's even hard for me to say this because she used to be a weak person. It's like want some juice. You know. No, not your hand. Everyone's safety is is now. We can't leave the house. My brother can't go to work. Die. Like my sister can't go to school. She's twelve years old. My mom can't even go to the grocery store. Now you worry about going to get groceries. I'm not here to play the victim. I'm here to take responsibility. <laughs> and you, and I, was about it. I didn't tell the truth to the people that I loved. You did. Not because of malicious intent, but because... You was protecting yourself. I was just scared. Each mm -hmm. step, what would you have done differently? Yeah, like guava. I would not have gone with those girls to... Blame. An after party. Yes, you would. And just not allow myself to be in positions to where I'm gonna hit them up tonight. I also <laughs> allow things to happen. And yet I would have. That's what I'm saying. Wow, cooking. Sounds like I was there. Yeah, that's, that's a life. This happened. Yeah. Then I wouldn't be in this position today. I got caught up in the lifestyle. 
Yeah, I'm cool Tristan, I thought I wanted to be. Tristan Thompson was blowing the bag. going with the flow of where life was taking me. Having to deal with losing my dad in such a crucial age in my life. Such a young age to where I think I know what I'm doing, but I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. You know, I've had to learn a lot about the power of telling the truth. Mm -hmm. Even in this stage of my life, you know, because streets get deeper and deeper, okay? <laughs> You'll learn that as you go. But we love to think, we that. To think that we're all no, super honest and that it's easy to tell the truth. Oh, oh, oh. But specifically when I was your age, I had no idea how to tell the truth or to even understand the power of telling the truth. I had to tell many lies. It is always better. Yeah, it's always better. But I had to tell many lies and get the consequence. He don't want nobody to tell lies. Learn. <laughs> <He's only laughs> you would rather take the pain of telling the truth than having to take the pain of telling a lie and then take the pain of having to rehabilitate what that lie is because the trust is already broken. The trust is broken. Can you talk to Kylie? I have. I told her I was coming to the table today. I think at this point it, it's gone too far and enough is enough and when the safety of the people I love is in jeopardy, I have to speak. Have you had an opportunity to talk to Chloe since then or have any kind of communication with her? No. I have spoken a little bit with her. I let her know that I'm willing to do whatever it takes for her peace of mind, not for my image, not for my career, because that's already something so, in its own. Yo, <laughs> black people are this is now. Right. Like our for your peace of mind. What's the, that so Jesse you know got? That there was no and Jordan. Malicious you know why it's Black History Month? They make us look bad this month. But she did that to her damn self. And so did that other stupid guy. Like raised you like a sister. Mm -hmm. That's this all, all three of them. Jesse and R. Kelly, we're not going to talk about that. So, even in understanding exactly what happened. <laughs> Attach me to a lie detector. Whatever it is, I need the people. Now you want a lie detector. I'm willing to take full responsibility. I'm not asking you know, for but people you, to you, like you me. Know you did. I'm not asking for you to forgive me overnight. I'm just asking for like you to hear me and to feel me. I just think getting everybody that process. And that's what I'm trying to do. That's a lot I'm to, you I'm to, share. to. I know, and, and you, you'll have to continue to. Mm -hmm. Because it, it takes many attempts. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. just allowing Kurtz to oh, heal yeah. little by little in order okay. for we need to pause this people and talk. to feel safe enough to Let's open enough to fast. invite a repair. I've had to learn that with people that I've hurt and people who've hurt me. Sometimes it takes years, sometimes it takes weeks, sometimes it takes days. But when there's a lot of love there, there's always a path and possibility towards you know healing. Jay, 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 can she complete a thought before you start talking? Can we have the fish bowl? I never get to hear the ending of anything. Nah, but keep it real though. Jay is just making it easy for her. That's how I usually do it. She's literally just telling her she has to own what she has. Taylor from Dublin, New York. Is this a publicity set? A lot of people think this is all just for the new season of mm. keeping up. Unfortunately, Taylor, I wish I could say this was a publicity set, but it's not. It's not real life. And real people are hurting. It's been real. Right. It's been yeah. real. I didn't think it was a scene. Let me take one. <sighs> Lauren from Texas, did you apologize to Chloe? I did. So you did do something wrong, man, if you apologize. I did as much apologizing as I could do over the phone, over text. And until I get the opportunity to talk face to face. She's actually really over it, so I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? But I, I reached out and the opportunity was there. I as her much too. as I could. A lie detector test, anything. Whatever makes you stop saying there's a lot of tech with tests, but at least they know it's there. Like but in the process of friend. her processing, I, told you about I can't see my family get hurt anymore. Yeah, so that's why I had to break my silence yeah. out of you know, I've been respectful through this whole thing. I haven't been commenting back, I've been you know, constantly being ridiculed and bullied, and I've still held my dignity. 
And I've been I get them bullets down when you slow them up. You know, just a week before, were telling me, you know, how much they love me, or yeah, it's so good. And I'm just, I'm, I'm more so the person where I get to see everyone's true colors now, as well as you have my phone number. They get to you, see your you true could, colors. You, oh, you could have. Why they need called, to call you? You know, but or like, text to me and those texts, text. but. I guess if everything's social now, it's, that's how people handle things. You know, I have to respect that too. But through that, I'm not going to be the person to clap back or to respond because you have no to the to fact it. that this is a real right? situation. We're not going to respond to it. You fucked up. You it's fucked not up. a game. Yeah. Right. This is not a drill. <laughs> this is not a drill. Okay. I shouldn't be laughing, girl. And I can tell you one right thing. Right. 90% of these people <laughs> were not my friends. 90%, not at 20. Right. 90. So this has been deeper than just uh, coming here. It's because you're family and it's someone that, even if this was the truth, there was no judgment. And you're willing to just. Well, you see how she snuck that in? Not means the world to me. She knows so, what she did. Jane I'm happy. happy. <laughs> I love her. I, I, I'm happy because now I'm a hooked one on a red table. I feel like I'm free. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you. I'm proud of you. I want to hear what Tristan got to say are. about this. Man, listen. You think they gonna be like, I hate that. that. You and think all I want was a kiss? <laughs> kiss because I hate like, that. Well, well he yeah. kissed her. After when she was, when she was yeah, leaving, you know, so obviously there was something in between that so she was sitting on the arm of the chair. I tell you this much: my girl ain't gonna be sitting on the arm of the I chair next to that nigga with her legs over on top of. Now that's more too much. If that's the case, case, then that's not my girl. With love and kindness, right. help her heal, and she is. Vice versa, I ain't gonna let no female do that. From this particular incident, and I just ask that we support her in that journey of growth because that's what we do here at the rtt family no she looks like she's about to so, cry right there you go i love you mom she didn't know she lied she, she like, didn't lie she literally just stated what happened she ain't tell like, everything she, she may have not over. she may have not but she owned up to what she did she slept with him she they had sex he hit that Jada asked her, did you sleep with him? She said no. Nah. She wasn't lying because they was up doing what they was doing. There was no sleeping. Why did you tell us something that makes you happy? You don't know what makes you happy. She definitely was up. She wasn't sleeping. Well, she should have asked her, did, did they have sex? Yeah, did y'all have sex together? Oh, we can't use that word. Did oh. they have... Did Was Bumpity Jumpity George doing the bumpity doing jumpity? The, doing the bump. They, doing the bump. <laughs> they was doing the bump. They was the hot shot waffles. They was doing all of that. He scrambled her eggs. He scrambled her eggs. What you talking about, man? He flipped And he pancakes. didn't even say nothing about it. Like, he ain't come out and apologize or nothing. So I know something definitely yeah, took place. What's there to apologize about? He lost his woman. But that's the thing. His he did his, what he did. He, he probably Chloe, apologized to her personally, but he's not gonna say it to the world. Chloe got with him while he was with somebody else. But you gotta look at the whole situation, though. Chloe, Chloe always picking these ball players. That's I ain't even gonna get there. But, but like, re be realistic. Like you, you was with Lamar. You was married to Lamar. He smoked crack. He smoked crack. But what does that have to do with this? She got horrible choice in men. Men. Yeah. She definitely do. Picking these bozo guys, they in the NBA, yeah, they doing something with themselves, but they bozos. You feel me? They ain't no LeBron, they ain't no Kobe's, they ain't nobody, they not even on no- Kobe ain't no good man, he ain't cheat on his but girl. But I'm saying though, Kobe <laughs> cheat on his girl is different from when Tristan cheat on his girl, cause, like, come on, it's Tristan. Who's Tristan? You get what I'm saying? Did you know what team he played on? But I guarantee you, you know what team Kobe played on. Yeah, because Kobe's legendary. All right, Tristan, like, that's what I mean. Tristan, Tristan's been playing for a while. Do you know what team Lamar Odom played on? This, um, the Lakers, right? Yeah, but he not legendary. He yeah, didn't start I, off on the Lakers. I, I I learned about him once he started dating Chloe. Though. Yeah, once he started dating Chloe. Before that, nobody knew who he was. Try to tell you, man, look, listen, man. You picking bozos, you going to get bozo results. For real, for real. <laughs> That's damn shame. That's crazy though, like, 
And she fronted. She, yo, if she would have went to any other place, to, she would have went to New York Times or whoever else. She would have interviewed anywhere else. They would have bombed her. They would have got the truth out of her. Oh, but yeah, because Jada's family. I think Jada was trying to be. Jada was being nice to her. Jada was being sympathetic and didn't want to tackle her because she knew she was like family. Like they, they basically, she, she watched her grow her whole life. She said so, that, right? But, so she wasn't going to come at her, but Jada never comes at anybody on her show. That's why she took the safe route on go, to going on um, the Red Table Talk. Yeah, she did right. that because she knew that would be the safest way to reveal her story. Tell me what y'all think, man. Please tell me what y'all think. If she gave it up, she gave it up, man. I'm she keeping it 100. She, she, she gave it up. You feel me? He kissed her at the it, end of the, at the It's 7 o'clock in the morning. You leaving his house. That's your homegirl's man. Right. Your homegirl's sister's man, even more. Like, come on. Like you right, know what's they up? All, they all treated her like, like, like part of the family. Like yeah, she was like, like a sister. She was always at the house. She lost some deals. That's why she up here trying to pull her heart she, out. She lost. She she's got this And court. that's the crazy thing. Before this came out, I said she's about to lose a lot because oh, the Kardashians have such a big name in Yo. the social media industry, the that's public right. eye. They are huge. Right now, they, they definitely they killing the game. And Definitely for you so, to have somebody's. a great relationship, this is why they say you can't ruin relationships. Like that was a relationship that she ruined. She, yeah, she burned that bridge. Definitely. She burned that bridge. She had, she like. It's different. They did something even to her. Care, she chose because she knew what it was. Well, her homegirl was like, "Oh yeah, we going to Tristan's house." She knew exactly who he was. She knew who she was to her friends she and did. to her herself. She so did. she ain't think about it. Like, nah, I'm not even gonna burn this bridge. She said. She, she, Let's just put this out there. Let's. What are some things that you think she did good? I'll say. She probably gave it up amazing to Tristan. One. I'm over you. <laughs> I'm saying that's the only thing she did good, is she probably performed extra well. Cause she, she probably got a bag from him. I doubt it. I know she lost a bag. She ain't. She, she definitely. <laughs> she definitely. <laughs> The she didn't think she was good. I, like I honestly can't say that she did anything good because she may have did something good for herself in that moment. She probably felt good about doing whatever she did, mm -hmm. but ultimately she thought she wasn't gonna get caught. But she wound up getting caught, so it was a wrap from her for there. Like she knew she would. Honestly, I wouldn't want a friend like her. You feel me? Yeah, I, th th that's out the window. Like, I would I not cannot, want a friend. I can't like, trust you around. My partner. Yeah, like, like. Then I know something's. I, I, I can't around, around my you. partner, but if I got a homeboy that has a girl, and you my peoples, or I got a brother, my brother's lady or something, or my sister's man or something, I wouldn't want nothing like that to happen. Like, I can't even trust you around my family members, significant others, because you're gonna do something that grimy, and you my friend, you make me look bad. Right. My, fam my family gonna be like, yo, Damn, you talk over me every two yo, let seconds. Me finish. I ain't Talk I, gotta get, I gotta get what I gotta get off my chest. Girl wanna talk all day. Cause she's slumber. She, 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 she vicious like. Listen, what I will say is, I'm happy that she came on the show and actually said something. Like, she, she put it out there that she did something wrong. Her actions were wrong. I agree with that. One thing I can say, that's one thing I can say she did good. But I honestly, <laughs> I honestly couldn't be around a person like that because I can't trust you. Like if trust is not there, I can't, I can't be around you because you're capable of doing anything at that point. Like even if it's not about sleeping with somebody or trying to flirt with someone, I can't trust you around anything. You get what I mean? Like I don't know if you're gonna be able to take from me because at the end of the day, yeah, you, you ain't care to hurt or yeah, you have no respect for the person I am. That's a fact. You know what I mean? I don't trust you around nothing. I don't want you around my kid. I don't want you around nothing because your trust, we we don't have trust no more. You your broke mor that Your already. moral compass your is way off. And I can't have nobody around me like that. At all. Alright. With that being said, let us know down in the comments how y'all feel about this. Yeah. Y'all feel she was bumpity jumpity Georgia. Or if you just feel like she kept it a buck and what she did do was wrong because ultimately she did admit that her wrongs. And a lot of people watch this segment like 
uh, what you call it? There's over 10 million views. Yeah, she did. in a day. So they both benefited from this. All I'm saying, man, is just do right in life. That's it, man. For real, do right in Always life. Always don't man. never want to burn a bridge, even if that 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 relationship is not what you expected it to be. You can always end things on a good term. Don't do nothing that's ever gonna hurt you or hurt the people that you do say you care about at a point in time in your life. Real shit. That's that, man. So guys, make sure y'all comment down below about what y'all thought about this Red Table Talk. If y'all enjoyed this, let us know down in the comments and we appreciate you guys for watching. And if you're new to the family, subscribe. Oh yes, subscribe. Definitely subscribe. And if you like more content like this to come out, let us know in the comments as well. And we'll definitely drop something else for y'all. Yes. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Peace. Deuces. Baby, man. All I'm telling you is, man. Turn it up. Nah, I'm going to keep it a buck. Tristan hit that. Because there ain't no way that at the end of the day, some dude's going to come to the door at 7 o'clock in the morning. You leave at his crib. And he giving you a kiss. And he giving you a kiss. There was a reason. And you know what that reason was? It started off at the beginning of the night when she was sitting on that arm of the couch. That man got, he got enough money to buy and he more was chicken. Definitely, he was definitely rubbing on that leg. Yup. She knew what she was about doing. She, oh, she was sitting off the, her legs was this way, so she put her legs the other way. For what? What was the purpose of you putting your legs right. over his legs? Right. And even giving people the impression, because obviously there's people there, there's eyes there, they taking phones, so... They already knew it was going down. Yeah. Let me get your phone. And you're the only person that's were... not aware of it. So your friends didn't tell you nothing. So now your friends are mischievous as well. So tell me, about where was your phone when all of this was going on? If you oh, wasn't... she didn't have her phone? I don't know. She never said if she had her phone or not. But she said she wasn't aware that the phone was going to be taken away or whatever the case may be. I don't know. Did she have a phone or not? Because she wasn't aware of this. Mm -hmm. You feel me? But at the end of the day, you going over there. And you sitting on the arm of the couch, you could have grabbed the chair, you could have grabbed the seat just like every other girl in that she place really did. Could've. She could have been like, yo, you know what? I'm friends. What 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 her ex is like, whoa, you you yeah, like, you wild. I would sit down in the chair, that. one of your homegirls could do what they want to do. You feel so me? So where did she sleep that night? That's she what I'm up saying. The whole night? Hold on, if there wasn't enough chairs and couch space, when did everybody sleep that night? She was the only one that stayed till seven? I gotta figure this out, man, because there's a whole lot of gaps in the story. It's way too many gaps. Too many in the gaps story. in the story, man. <laughs> and Chloe, let us, Tristan, let us know. Keep it a buck. I know you're gonna keep it official. For real, so, yeah, you need to come out with your part of the story. And, yeah, and, and talk your piece because the brothers need to know what really happened <laughs> when you hit that. Because I know you hit that. He definitely did. How it went down, it was like. He definitely, he definitely, definitely did hit that. that. Word, that's crazy. That's sad. Man, listen, I'll tell you, you know what he did, right? Who? He, you know oh, what he Tristan. did. Put the yeah. key in the ignition. You know what he did. Turn it. That's it. Turn the cam 